Mr. Zombie Reacts. Yo, what's good, my zombies? Thank you for joining me for another Mr. Zombie Reacts episode. It's your boy, Mr. Zombie, and today we are going to be looking at Metal Gear Solid Delta Snake Eater, and this is going to be the first in-engine look. Uh, I found out about this a couple days ago, man, that they released like a, uh, I want to say like a minute and 40 second video on how it's going to look. Now, I don't know if it's going to look awesome or what. All I know, it's, it is going to be a huge upgrade from the PlayStation 2 games. Uh, I did get the uh, Metal Gear Solid uh, collection, so I'm, I'm, uh, I'm excited to play that shit and, and you know, continue on it's been a long time i haven't played those i don't know if i should live stream them or i should just record them slash edit them and then upload them you guys drop uh, your opinion your comments maybe i don't give a fuck or whatever it is what it is to my loyal zombies if y'all do care let me know if you want me to live stream that shit or just straight up just edit that motherfucker and upload it but yeah let's get into it man let's check it out um this small little uh clip i want to say clip man because it's pretty small and see how it looks yes first in engine look metal gear solid delta pre-alpha footage i mean it it's already looking good to be honest Dude, come on. Look at the fucking details in this game. It looks like Metal Gear Solid 4. I wanted to shoot I wanted to see him shoot him in the fucking head. But a tranquilizer more than likely. Bro. Hell yeah. This looks awesome. I know they're just trying to show us the small little details of the game. I mean, yeah, it looks fucking dope. I'm not gonna lie. And that's all we have right now at this moment. Unreal Engine 5. And yes, of course, we already know it is going to be coming out for uh, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series uh, X and S and Steam. Not much to look at here. It's just showing us little details of the game and, uh, you know, the, the surrounding areas and, you know, him getting into mud and seeing the detail on that and how real it looks. Uh, I don't know what's your opinion to me. It, it does look interesting. Of course, it's Metal Gear, so who the fuck is not interested in this? Um... I'm looking at everything here, man, and uh, I like the small details, man, and everything. I'm seeing the water, the dirt, that fucking crocodile-looking thing, and then uh, we can see here the dirt, man, the detail of how he was, like, totally submerged in the water slash, you know, with the dirt, and it just stays with you, and I guess it dries up, dries up over time, and I, I like the small little details in games, bro. I do look for details. Uh... I've always been like that every time I, I do play a game it, it, you know I look at small things like when I played spider-man 2 the game looks awesome I don't have nothing bad to say about it uh, but I did trip out on the banana scene the banana scene when he was cleaning his house the bananas look pretty fucking polygon you know and I'm not saying that games have to look perfect but damn it did look really polygon to me it just reminded me of like PlayStation 3 graphics but that's just me Maybe it's not a big fucking deal. I could deal. do a better Probably job with the bananas, this is not bro. A big deal, but I'm just looking at the small details. Um, I like this part right here. It does remind me of Metal Gear Solid 4. Uh, when um, before you get to a house and uh, before you get to uh, your first actual boss in the game, it's been a fucking long time, dude. I don't even remember the the name of the character is Naomi. I think when you go meet Naomi, I don't know, but this part reminds me of that shit. You see all the little guinea pigs walking around and stuff. So the details here, man, they look awesome. I I'm, I'm liking it. All these details right here. Uh, so of course it shows us, you know, we're able to see first person view, shoot the guy in the head, you know, with a tranquilizer, put him to sleep or whatever. Uh, see him here fucking just 
you know, on the on the cliff and everything. Grabbing on enemies. Of course, we already know Metal Gear is about that. After that, man, it just kind of shows us a little detail of, uh, you know, the the whole surrounded area. And, uh, I mean, it looks pretty cool. I know they zoom into all of this, but you can't deny, man. It looks fucking awesome. Yeah, I do like this shot here of Solid, uh, Solid Snake, uh, or, of course, Naked Snake. My bad. Don't crucify me on that. I do like that. They put so much detail in, in the character. He looks fucking dope, man. Like, to me... He's always reminded me of uh, Hugh Jackman, always, you know. And I don't know, maybe uh, Hideo Kojima when he created these games, I don't know, he had Hugh Jackman in mind or maybe somebody else. Uh, but I know that he did say that he wanted a character or an actor to play Solid Snake from uh, a movie called The Guard. If you guys haven't checked it out, check it out. Unfortunately, the guy who did, he, he did recommend that to him, I guess, looked like Solid Snake. He unfortunately passed away. He also came out in Moon Knight, I believe, uh, for a bit. And uh, he, he passed away, I think, like two years ago. So that kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, man. I mean, there's no reason for us to look at this fucking bird here. But yeah, it's just so, it's showing us the surrounding areas of everything and then that fucking crocodile again. So uh, let me know what you guys think about the uh, first in-engine look of Metal Gear Solid Delta slash AKA Snake Eater. I'm excited for this, man. I, I, I know I say the word excited so much, but that's how I really feel. I'm very intrigued to find out what's gonna happen next. And more than likely they will release like, release like, a, like a trailer uh, to the game. And I'll be more than happy to check that out. But drop your comment down, down below. Dude, I don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> I'm like twisting my words here. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think about uh, Snake Eaters. And if it's a uh, thumbs up or thumbs down to you, I don't know. To me, it's a thumbs up because, of course, it's Metal Gear Solid. So, peace. I'll see y'all later.